All right, so I think I got this down here. So first thing we're gonna wanna do is uh, we'll go to linksys.com, I think. Uh, click on Linksys. Support this guy right here. Then go down to Linksys. And then you'll type in 610N. That's the model of your router. That's a WRT 610N. Should pull up the page here. And click on Downloads over here. And then your hardware version, you're going to select which version you have. I think you had number two, but it says it on the bottom of the router. So just uh, choose what model you have or what version of the hardware you have. Just for kicks, I'm going to hit version two because I think that's what you had. And then you're going to want to download this firmware right here. I don't know if you can see that. Oh, that helps a little bit. Firmware right there so we'll click on download and oh over here uh, you'll want to save this bin file like on your desktop so save it and let's see where did it save it to then oh it's downloading it I guess this one is for my router, so don't worry about that. But we're saving this bin file right there for your router. Alrighty. So say you you have that downloaded, so that's that's downloaded, right? Um, then you'll come over here to your router. Your router has this reset button on it here. You have to hold that in for 30 seconds until all the lights. Oh boy. All the lights uh, stop flashing, I guess. I guess it doesn't like to be thrown around. Interesting. Okay. Anyway, so until all those lights reset, and then, then what we'll do, looks like all the downloads are done. All right, so I'm going to put the camera down and plug. Then you got to plug the computer into the router. So all this was, all this internet stuff's done on when your computer's plugged in the modem because you obviously can't get internet through your router, right? So, uh, let me put the camera down and I'll plug the computer into this thing here. Computer's plugged into there. So then, theoretically, let me open up a new browser. All right, so now it's saying we, we don't have internet because we don't have internet. So let me, then we go to 192.168.1.1 because we've reset it. So that should open up a page that looks like, no, not like this. Hold on. See, it's going to ask you for your username and password. And uh, it's not what I wanted it to do. I try to reset the history here. You shouldn't have to do this. A lot of crap on here, I guess. Oh gosh. All right. Let's try this again here. So we go to 192.168.101. Piece of garbage. So anyway, usually, well, because I plugged this in and tested it already, it said, oh my gosh, your router isn't protected. It gave you three little boxes right here that says, what do you want to change your username? What do you want to change your password? What do you want to change? Oh username password and then confirm your password if it said that right there so I just changed all of them to admin and then password is admin and then it said change password box right here you click that 
So I did that. So change that. So my username is admin. My password is admin. Okay. So we click that. And then we get into the router. This this is all this crap or whatever. So this is where we run into issues. This is the DDWRT firmware that we were playing around with that we screwed up real bad. So let me come over here to administration, I think. And then we do a firmware upgrade. And I think what we can do then, you're going to hit browse. And then you're going to point to this bin file that you downloaded. And that's going to load that software onto your router again. So it's going to load the Linksys software. I have to do this one because my router is different than you. Oh my gosh. My router is different than yours. And my computer sucks. Big time. Okay, so this bin file is what you're looking for right here. It's a .bin file. This is the one that we downloaded onto your desktop previously, so we'll hit open on that. So that's saying, oh my gosh, we're going to download this. We're going we're gonna to reset to default settings. Hit upgrade. It's going to upgrade the firmware. Hope this works, otherwise it's gonna be a waste of time. I should check this text message on my phone. Okie dokie. So how's California? Yes. I don't really want to pause the video, otherwise it's just going to take forever to load on YouTube, so, sorry. is successful. I'm going to pause the video because chances are you're not going to be able to watch this video while your router's rebooting anyway. So I'll just upload two videos.